How's everybody doing out there? I'm here at the Hobby Superstore. And I thought High Noon was supposed to be here. Lakewood. Man, I didn't see the fine print there. So anyway, I'm going to go in, have a good time. Sorry, guys. Uh, we're going to see what we can shoot, if I'm allowed. And see if I can get an antenna and a motor mount and look for a future plane. Please uh, come on inside and just take a look. We're in the store and I'm at the uh, train section. And one of the areas that I used to be into the hobby. Beautifully a uh, nice track here. Take a look at the other track they have. Down the aisles is where I'm going to go look at the uh, RC planes. So before we head there, I'll back up, give you a little bit of a uh, view of the store. Now remember, you have a pause on video. Pause the camera if you see something down the aisle. These are just general toys. So let's head on down towards the front of the store. Here is a real small uh, section of the uh, train. Beautiful. Something I want to do when I was upstairs in the apartment. Put a track on the wall on the top. Cut a little holes there. Very, very interesting. We'll walk around to the other side and see what it looks like. Beautifully, beautifully made. This is Horizon Blade that was advertised by Hobby Zone for $50. Something I used to be into, the old time slot cars. And then we got some rockets and the area where I used to uh, get into are the remote control cars. Different types of paints different types of models. Go to Toys R Us, you can't find these anymore. Some smaller scale planes, World War II. Something that if you had a desk. And then some helicopters. And some tanks. Some more types of airplanes. And then different types of commercial airlines and helicopters. <laughs> the good old classic cars. And this is where I am taking my time because this is what I'm interested in. A little bit more of the cars than the planes at this moment. 
beautiful, beautiful models. We'll scroll down and check out some more. And then we come to the more modern cars. No matter what size, or what scale, you have all different types to look at, even tractor trailers, and the good old buggy, even down to a real small scale bus, to a police car. The good old Beagle family. Had different types of wheels, all different types of cars. Everything you can choose from in a car. So let's turn around and see what else is around here. The planes are there. So we're looking at the blade over here and the other one was the Scout, the CX-2 so let's get to the planes where I came for the F-270 Striker the Schmeiter and here's the Hobby Zone Champ the Abras the Mini Super Cub the Trojan T-28 51D Mustang And the Super Cub that we fly, the Sukhoi SU-26, F4U Corsair, the Mesquite, the s back the Amber 2, Striker Smaller Scale, the Foresight, Playmate, Snap and Fly, some 3D Foams, Night Vapor, and the Herbalites. This seems to be the Spitfire and some repetitive models. Just put on shelf. And there's more champs and a sh some wings and all that good stuff. I was going to hesitate there. So let's take a look what's on the side here. So I came around and said the Horizon Blade, which is a Scout CX over here, the Proto CX, the Herbalite. Pretty interesting. Park Zone had a lot of stuff on the shelf, and this is Hobby Zone's area. This is where the Super Cub, I could get some of my parts. And here is the drop for dollar more, 18 to 19.99. But hey, here's Aerial Drop a Module for $18. I think I will pick one up just for the hell of it. Here is the firewall with screws and radiant. Not what I need but I'm looking for the other type for the cub. They have the parts here but not the cowl. The cowl seems to be not available. Three dollars for a complete tail kit. That is a seven dollar savings. These are helicopter parts. A lot of different parts. Normally you'll see anywhere around. And these are the helicopters. And this looks like the helicopter I have given to a particular person. Not upset. I didn't pay that price. I paid a lot less for it. Now's the time for me to pick one up if I want one. What a wonderful time in the store. Had a great time. One little box of the Hobby Zone Champ Parts. A small section for the Super Cub and a good number of planes. 
The store is very big, much bigger than the stores back home. A lot of stuff in there. Very pleased I came. Very well presented. Very helpful. Some parts expensive, a lot of parts are inexpensive. Walked out with a new TX antenna for the Spectrum from E-Flight. It is Spectrum. Walked out with a new cowl for the same price online. As well as one other thing which I cannot remember what I purchased. I think it was a bomb drop for the same amount of price. So I did save money and tax on the items. You guys, thank you very much. Hope you enjoyed this long, extensive walk around of the Hobby Superstore in Plantation, Florida. Have a great day and thank you for joining me on the trip.